Firstly, we will do remote installation. Please open the app named Mini Wi-Fi Cam and choose click here to add camera. Then choose manually add and put in any name you want to give to the camera. Please be noted the ID should be all capitalized letters with hyphen and numbers, which is shown here. And the original username is admin, which are all lowercase letters with no passwords. If the administrator user already changed the username and password, please let them do the same changes. Now please choose save and after a few seconds it is done. Now we return back to camera list. We will see all cameras added in the app. And we could choose gallery to check all pictures and videos in your mobile. Now click any video to playback. And we could also delete any files as we want. If we choose system we will could choose to receive push message if we want. And we will also see the version information. And we just return to cameras list. Choose a camera. We could able or disable the sound. Able or disable two way talking. Which is only available in some of our models. Change a resolution if we want. Make a video recording in mobile. Or just take a picture instead. Again we come back to the cameras list. Choose the gear on the right. And we will see a manual. TF is to check the records in micro SD of the camera. Settings is to set Wi-Fi or email alarm. Or motion detection. Or username and password. Adjust is to do time synchronization as per your mobile time. Delete is to delete the camera added. Edit is to change the camera information, which is similar to user settings. Now we go into settings. We could set email alarm and once there is a motion, we could receive pictures in our email box. We could do alarm settings. Able or disable motion detection or sending email or alarm recording. And we could user settings to set an username and password. This is important to protect the privacy. Please be noted that only the administrator user could do the main settings. And in some case, if the Wi-Fi internet password is wrongly input, and the camera could not be connected to internet, please just delete the camera and press the restart button on the camera. For restore default, it is for some case that you forget the username or password, or you input a wrong Wi-Fi internet password. So once it is done, you will have to reinstall the camera from the Wi-Fi hotspot which is shown as per our video installation demo.